Welcome back. I'm Dale Rogers. All good things one day come to an end. And for Sacramento native Cameron Iwasa, the time has come, as he says, to hang up his cleats. KSRA 3 Michelle Dapper has more on this storied soccer career with this week's My 58 Superstar of the Week. When you're part of Sacramento, Sacramento loves you and accepts you. And I think that was even deeper for me, being that I grew up here. Cameron Iwasa has cemented himself as Sacramento soccer royalty. When you hear Sacramento Republic, you automatically think of Cameron Iwasa. Soccer skills extending far beyond his years. A tiny tyke outcrossing the young competition. <laughs> With that bright, cheesy smile, Cam was a winner from the start. A two-time section champ at Jesuit, scoring 42 goals his senior year while earning league MVP honors. That team went 31 and 0, and um, and Cam obviously was a big. Anytime you score 42 goals, that's a big piece of it. Kind of a bulldog. Uh, once he gets going, it's hard to knock him off the ball. At UC Irvine, he netted 22 goals, good enough for 10th most in school history. <laughs> Now the 28-year-old leads his hometown club as the Republic's all-time leading scorer in goals and assists. It's a pretty easy one for me. It's the goal I scored in Reno in 2019 uh, in the playoff game. Uh, it's my only playoff goal, and it ended up going down as the game winner that day. But the stoppage time would come in 2021, as Cam decided to say farewell to the beautiful game and the indomitable club that's embraced him. I think the biggest thing for me is like just where I'm at in my personal life. I'm getting married in just over a month. Uh, the plan is to try to start a family shortly thereafter. and. You know, the one thing I tell people is like, obviously this business, this game is incredible. It's so fun and it's really cool to say that, you know, this is what I do for a living. Uh, but at the same time, the stability of it is very fleeting. A young kid from Sacramento has managed to play for his hometown team and not only play for his hometown team, be the franchise player on his hometown team. So if I'm a young kid and I see that, that's something special. That's something that dreams are made of. And Cameron's, Cameron's lived, out, lived out his dream. And after seven seasons in the USL, Cam will play his final professional soccer match right here at Heart Health Park. I think every time he crosses that white line, you know what you're going to get. He's going to give you absolutely everything he has. Just the feeling of suiting up and getting out there under the lights. Uh, that level of competition is something that I don't think you can find outside of that. And so uh, once that's gone, it'll be tough. You know, I'll, I'll try to be as competitive as I can on the golf course, but it's not quite the same. <laughs> A fairy tale finish to his storied soccer career. In the 77th minute, Iwasa scored his 60th and final career goal in the regular season finale against San Diego. And what a send off! The backflip is the exclamation point! That's the best backflip by far I've ever, ever seen him do. Um, and, and you know what? Save the best for last. You know, these guys being able to show up every day and basically hang out and play a game with your friends uh, and get paid to do it. Uh, I, I really don't think there's anything better in the world. He will rightly see a standing ovation here at Heart Health Park. Cam wraps up his career as the eighth all-time leading scorer in USL championship history. But his greatest impact extends far beyond the jersey. There's been various people that have said, hey, you know, we watched a game and Cam was my kid's favorite player and now they wear number 31 and they want to be a soccer player and this and that. And I think to me that's the coolest thing. In Sacramento, Michelle Dapper, KCRA 3 News.